Good morning, Brandy. Good morning, Kat. I'm not going to sing back to Come you. Come on, baby. I'm a singer. <laughs> um, what are you making for me this morning? Making coffee punch. <laughs> <laughs> That's 3D. Um, yeah. All right, so uh, it looks kind of naughty because you got a bunch of ice cream going on. So, it's so what sugary. is it? Um, okay. So I I started early on the coffee part of it because you have to let it cool for about an hour. Okay. Um, and so it's eight cups of coffee three quarters of a cup of sugar dissolved in that, and then you put it in the fridge and just let it cool. Oh, okay, so you did that beforehand. Yes, I did. To get it all dissolved in there and it's all chilled out, okay. Mm -hmm. And so the next thing you do, once it's chill um, and you're ready to have your party where you're gonna serve your punch mm -hmm. out, you wanna add the rest of the ingredients. Because okay. Because they'll, they'll kind of melt and go bad pretty fast if you're not ready to serve it. Got it. Um, so we're gonna start with a half pint of heavy whipping cream. Whoa, okay. Yeah. Naughty. This, yeah, this whole thing is naughty. We're going to stir that in. And did you use, uh, is this uh, Twilight? Is that the coffee? Do you know? Of course it is. Okay. I love my Twilight. Thank you, Belton. Yes. <laughs> it keeps us all hopped up and... Oh, yeah. This is why we work so hard. This is why we work so hard. <laughs> you know, when there's another coffee in the, in the Technoform, I'm like, hmm, this tastes weird. <laughs> Because it's not my twilight. Exactly. Okay, so once that's all blended nicely, we're going to add our ice cream. Okay. And it's going to be, so um, the ice cream usually comes in like a one gallon container. Mm -hmm. So you're going to use a quarter of that container. <laughs> and we're using two different types of ice cream. Okay. So we're using a half gallon of ice cream. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Is that basically what you have going on here? Yeah, so we, All have, right. we have a quarter gallon of vanilla mm -hmm. and a quarter of chocolate. Okay. This is going to be really naughty. And then you just scoop and stir because you want it all mixed in there. And it'll kind of float. It's like, you know, the party punches. Oh, okay. This so is, do you want to incorporate the ice cream or do you want to just kind of float it in there and let it kind of start melting of its own accord? I think a little bit of both. Okay. Well, it's, see, it's incorporating itself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm impatient. Let's just dump the whole bowl. Yeah. There we go. Give it a little stir, and then we'll add our vanilla in. Oh, this is going to be yummy. See, it's football season, and my husband loves to watch football, and mm -hmm. I love to have parties. <laughs> so. so this is like a perfect mix. Yep. You can make this for His little the football parties, mm -hmm. and it's good for baby showers. It's something. Well, no, never mind. You can use decaf for the mother. <laughs> How's it looking to you? It looks good. <laughs> so there you have it. There's the coffee, coffee punch. Coffee punch. All right. So you're, you're going to serve up a... Of course. Whoa, a big hunk of vanilla. i got to get the chocolate in there, too. Mm. Oh, wow. All right. That is excellent. Let me try. Mmm. That is really good. And easy. I mean, if you brew up the coffee beforehand, throw it in the fridge, mm -hmm. pretty easy to put together. Yeah, or you can do like a soft brew and just leave it in there overnight. Mm -hmm. You know, however you want to get your coffee cooled. That would make it a lot coffeeier. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's not really a word, but <laughs> a lot coffeeier. More, more to the coffee. <laughs> it's early. Yes, it is. Cool. All right, Randy. Thank you very much. That's the coffee punch. Punch. <laughs> All right. Bye, cat. Bye.